Hello everyone, I'm going to be recording my laptop today because my phone, I don't want to risk the phone audio being absolutely terrible because that has happened a few times. So we're going to be doing a review on the three new plushies I got from eBay. Uh, so, I'm very careful with my purchases now. I used to get like all the fake ones, but now I'm having to spend like maybe, maybe about $50 on each of these. It's crazy. But um, yeah, basically we're going to be heading on to my first, the first one, which is no my cupcake. I absolutely love the look of this plush. Just just who wouldn't want this thing? It's so cool. I love the mouth and the eyes. The eyes are probably the best. They are just the creepiest thing. I have it on top of my TV and every night I just stare at it and I'm like I regret putting it there. Like <laughs> I regret putting it. Oh my god, I've got the other two up there as well. We've got a load of them. Ah, one's turned for you. Just chuck these down here. Right. Block out the sun again because the sun is kind of annoying, I've seen. Uh, but yeah, Nightmare Cupcake, you've got all the withering on each side of the head there, and you've got the withering around the eyes. This is probably the most amazing thing to look at. It's very well done for its design, and the candle just looks amazing. I love it. And this is actually made out of um, it's like a really kind of it feels rubbery, it's like a rubbery plastic. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it's basically that, but it's the teeth design's really good. Another thing about this, this is a really cool uh, cupcake. It's my favourite cupcake I got in the collection so far. Uh, slime cake's my second favourite, and yeah. All right, next we have. I'm gonna do these two next because yeah, Golden Freddy. <laughs> He actually looks adorable. These are fake. These ones are fake, but they're really good fakes. Like, for once, I bought a fake and I was like, I don't know if these are going to look good, but I saw the reviews on Amazon. These these two I got from Amazon, the other one over there. And I was like, I don't know about these. And I looked at all the, the pictures and stuff, and they looked all right. So I was like, you know what, I'm just going to go for it. I don't regret it. These are really well done. These plus, they were £20, but these are very... I know these are sha uh, uh, Sanchi um, knockoffs. I know that because his eyes are darted the same way that the Sanchi ones are. No, I think the Sanchi ones are that way, but I don't know. But they're darted, kind of like how the Sanchi one is on Golden Freddy, but it's actually gold. The, the colour is gold. It's not just bright yellow like that other one was that's in the box, I think. Yeah, it's down there in the box. It's not like a full bright yellow. It's actually gold, so it's the right colour for a start. Uh, the hat's pretty good i mean the the felt at the top isn't too great but the eyebrows and the eyes are 3d eyes are hard but yeah no i really don't regret this it's such a good plushie for a knockoff in my opinion this is probably the best knockoff i've gotten it's very good and it's very soft as well so don't regret it it's really good so this is gone freddy i'm never ever gonna give this to anybody i'm gonna keep it forever because i love gold freddy's of course and then we have Shadow Freddy, which was the first one I got after... Well, I got Golden Freddy after this one. So Shadow Freddy is the same company I got from uh, with Golden Freddy. Again, don't regret it. He's puffy, like really, really fat and soft. He's just adorable, this, this one. Again, hat felt isn't too great, but his eyebrows and his eyes are very good. Um, his, like, sides of his head are not the same. You can just tell by looking at him. But he, I love how he's got the slanted mouth and his nose is very good as well. Um, but yeah, again, perfect colours. There's not really much to say about the colours. The colours look alright. And I, again, just think it's a great plush. It's for a knockoff. It's amazing. I didn't really... I really hated the other knockoffs. Like, you know the ones that are really small? They're like this and they, they just look horrible. These are actual decent quality um, knockoffs. So... I don't, again, regret buying this because I'm very happy with this knockoff. It's not actually that bad. It's fine, in my opinion. It's pretty good. So, so in a, <laughs> actually, Sophie commented, my friend Wolf, uh, Wolf Lover, commented that these two look like angry twins, which, <laughs> you know, it does work. It does work very well. But I think Golden Freddy looks a lot better than Shadow Freddy because Golden Freddy isn't stuffed. Shadow Freddy's, like, really hard, very, very stuffed. When Golden Freddy isn't really, he's like perfect stuff, the quality. So, yeah, I'm happy with those two. 
We are heading on to the newest one I got, Freddy Frostbear. This is a Walmart exclusive I got again from America. These, this one came from England. This was fifty pound, and then the two that I've got here are from America. So this one I I wanted just because it actually looks really cool, like the Freddy Frostbear. Its hat is a different type of hat to what Freddy Fazbear's is. Like his is like more of a kind of oh, I don't know what the material is. It looks more like felt, if you know what felt is. It's more felty than what the other ones were, which I think was more fabric. So that's felt. You can't really model it with felt that well because it just kind of sticks up. But in a way, it looks okay. Uh, you've got like the, um, what's it? I think it's the mistletoe or the berries there, um, which again, looks great on the hat. I can't lie. It is just a stick on print, but it's okay for what it is. Uh, nose is secure, that's not going anywhere, and the eyes are all embroidered as well, so it's a decent quality. I know the bow tie is printed, I can tell by um, the feeling of it and how it looks anyway, but except from that, it's a very good plush, it's nice and soft, obviously it's brand new, it's got the new tag on it, so this wasn't used, this is a brand new plush, that's probably why it's so expensive, um, and yeah, I, I'm just full on. Amazing this plush. This was the last one that came from America. Uh, Phantom Foxy came first. There you go. And um, we'll be showing Phantom Foxy in a second. But yeah, Freddy Frostbear. Pretty nice plush. I can't wait to use him in the Lol Bitway series. So excited. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the recent one, by the way. That's probably the best one I've made so far. Uh, but yeah, this is a very nice plush for what it is. It looks spooky and it looks darn right amazing. I'm pretty happy with this. Right. My favourite one out of every single one. Phantom Foxy. I love this plush. This is my favourite plush out of all the ones that I have. Including Lolbit, by the way. This is my favourite one. Uh, Lolbit's probably my second out of the whole collection. Um, but Phantom Foxy is my first. He is... I don't know. It's just something about what he's made out of. Like the... Kind of like the fluffy metallic material stuff. I don't know what to call it. But it's really nice. It's really, really not. I love it. Everything about this is just amazing. Um, we'll say that his eye patch is a little off compared to his eye, but that's about it. This was a used plush, so someone's had this before, but I, I actually don't care because it's still in like amazing condition. It's not been ripped. There's nothing wrong with it. It's still very brand new. But uh, yeah, it's the the green and brown. Just makes it look like a mint chocolate colour, if you know what I mean. But I love it. That, that's It just looks great. You know, that's Phantom Foxy from FNAF 3. Can't get better than that. It just looks really good, the design. Uh, the ears are a bit odd because they don't stand up properly. But in a way, I kind of like the way they just flap over because it kind of works. <laughs> but yeah, I love Phantom Foxy. This is probably the best plush I own. I've always wanted Phantom Foxy ever since it came out, but this was when I wasn't earning money, blah, 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 stuff like that. And I was like, I'm never going to get that plush. <laughs> but yeah, thanks to you guys and all your support and all this. And, you know, this would never be, this would never be what it is now. It would never, I would never be in this position if it wasn't for you guys. So I really do thank you for your support. And um, it really does mean a lot to me. Like, honestly, I know I don't say that enough, but I, you know... <laughs> It really does mean a lot, and I thank you so much for all your support throughout 2021, and hopefully it continues through 2022. But yeah, Final Foxy looks so good. Uh, the eye again is uh, 3D, and it's squishy compared to the knockoffs. But uh, I'm not going to call them knockoffs anymore. I kind of like them, so we ain't going to call them bootlegs or that. So we're just going to call them Golden Freddy and Shadow Freddy. So I will be honest. I really did try and get the Funko ones. But they're, they're just nowhere to be seen now. You can't find them anywhere. Uh, and when I did find them, they were really ridiculously expensive. It would be like £200 for me to just get over here. So that's a bit much for my, for my um, what's it, my limit. So I wouldn't spend that much. So I just got the knockoffs. And you know what? They look fine. I ain't ever going to change them now. But yeah, um, Final Foxy looks good. He is probably my favourite. Now, if we compare the size difference between, obviously this thing is a, I think it's an 18 centimeter or a 20 centimeter, and then you've got the Funko ones next to them. They're not that bad of a size, really. They're not too bad. 
a Golden Freddy just looks like a massive giant compared to these guys, but there's not really much problem with that, to be honest. I ain't really fussed. So, yeah. I was thinking of getting the um, Sanchi ones, so like the Sanchi Chica, Sanchi Freddy, and uh, Sanchi Bonnie. But I don't know now. I might, just because Chica, the Sanchi Chica with like the cupcake that can connect her arm is really cool. So I might, I don't know. But yeah, my next three that I'm going to buy next month, because I'll buy three plushies each month, I'm going to be getting Chocolate Bonnie, Bonnet, and the original Mangle, or no, the original Funtime Foxy from like the first roster of characters. So, well, the first ones that Funko ever released. So I'm going to be getting those three next month when I'm paid again. So, but anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this little review. I'm going to be doing these types of plush reviews every month once they come through the post. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye, everybody. Hope you're enjoying all the content that's coming out, by the way, because you've got your flippy one tomorrow and you got this one coming later on today. So I really hope you guys do enjoy the uploads that I'm rapidly getting out for you guys but yeah uh there's gonna be a news update in about a week's time so i'm gonna be doing a news update by the end of next week so i hope you guys are looking forward to that but anyway hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one goodbye everybody